Welcome to the Layer 2 Tech Navigation WebPart product video. My name is Lars Falinski and I'm working as a sales consultant for Layer 2. As a Microsoft Gold certified partner and ISV based in Hamburg, Layer 2 is one of the leading providers of Microsoft SharePoint and Office 365 apps in Europe with a major focus on data integration, collaborative knowledge management and social network. Layer 2 is also known as a reliable partner to customers in Central Europe offering additional consulting services in the fields of SharePoint, .NET programming and IT infrastructure for more than 20 years. The Layer 2 Tech Navigation web port for Microsoft SharePoint 2010 and 2013 is a standalone product within the Layer 2 knowledge management suite. The Tech Navigation web part displays taxonomies of managed metadata, terms, enterprise keywords, or social tags right from the SharePoint Term Store as an additional hierarchical tree-style navigation, for example for products, services, organizational structure, or other company issues. In this demo, I will show you how to use the Layer 2 Tech Navigation web part for content navigation and search in your portal. I will also explain the basic configuration options for the web part. In my portal, I created a site, Tech Navigation, a default SharePoint site. I added the Layer 2 Tech Navigation web part to this site. A default search web part is placed right next to it. Let's take a closer look at the Layer 2 Tech Navigation web part and the web part properties. Within the custom settings, the essential settings of the web part are made to adapt the behavior and style of specific requirements. You can specify whether terms or social tags should be displayed. Terms are expressions that are centrally managed hierarchically in the SharePoint Term Store. Social tags are terms that are freely assigned by the users and have a flat hierarchy. In my demo, I want to show you the content of a specific term set for content navigation, therefore I'm using the setting terms. In addition, the display option can be specified. You can simply display all terms of a term set or alternatively terms can only be showed whenever they are assigned to content in the current site collection. I want to use this setting. In the section Terms Root Not of the web part properties, the content structure of my term store is displayed. I have the opportunity to select the entire content, a term group, a term set or a single term as a start point. I want to use the content of the term set layer 2 corporate taxonomy for the hierarchical content navigation. In addition, I adjust the link to the search page in the section result link template because the results should be displayed on the same page. By default, the link points to the default search page of the site collection. I close the settings that I've just made with a click on OK and release the site. We can now see that all used terms of the selected term set are presented on the left side with the same structure as a term store. If I click on infrastructure or SharePoint server, I will get the results which are categorized by these terms within the search web part on the right hand side. For very large taxonomies, it may be reasonable to show the tree structure dynamically instead of statically. The advantage would be that users don't have to scroll down to select terms that are located at the end of the taxonomy. This is also possible with the Layer 2 Tech Navigation web part. It offers different XSL templates that can be selected via a drop-down box. In addition, custom XSL templates can be used. I will now change the display from static to dynamic, so you can get an impression of the dynamic representation. As you can see now, the structure of the Tech Navigation web part can be extended dynamically with a simple click. Required content can be found faster and more accurate by using the navigation. Users get access to the entire corporate knowledge regardless of the location of the information storage through the tree structure of the web part. By displaying the term description, you can use the web part as a technical glossary which describes the usage of terminologies or technical language of a specific area ensuring the correct use of these terms and their clear understanding within the company. The Tag Navigation web part can be downloaded from the Layer 2 product pages and can be used free of charge with some functional limitations as a server edition. For the full functionality, you need to purchase a license. 